Yes. Unity consciousness all about love. My check one, two. Eerie, eerie. I'm on your oxygen element to change your point of view of your periodic table. Now, hmm. Let's see. You have the oxycutum for your acne. Right. The number eight, review. Google this. Your meniscus in your knee. So put down, Jay. Makes a figure eight. Okay. Notice your three nines there for your mark of the beast. I'll review that later. Notice your one five is six. That's multiple six. Nine is a six, y'all. You must know your magic and how your Freemasons think. And the secret society is about your truth. Woo! Now, oxygen, etymology. Take your time, Jay. Slow it down. Pertains to what? Sharp. Acid. A.K. Akhenaten, the pharaoh. The A.K. 47. Blam, blam, blam. Hmm. Also pertains to oxtail. Okay, for animals now. Don't eat animals. It is not good for your intestines anyways. It is dead flesh. You're eating death. Animals don't come looking for you, do they? Your cows don't come um, on your door coming to eat you for protein. Your lions don't do that. Bears, eagle, any one of them could find you. Notice they stay in their lane and you don't. The hunter. Oxtail is, of course, your ox. Oxecutum. Okay, execute? You better wake up, people. Wow. The box cutter uh, for my, my gangsters? Okay. Your ox is Boss Taurus. I'm from Boston, y'all. Slow down, Jay. That is your tuberculosis. TB, you need to wake up. Taurus is a bull constellation. The black ox. Hi. Wake up, y'all. Taurus. Simple etymology. Nowhere to go. Astrology. Why is it important? Zodiac is circle of little animals. And it is the girdle of the sky. Review. Your pelvis etymology means a girdle. Okay. Review. Your cerebellum, even, even, or your bullum, Sandra Bullock, actress, is the hind brain of a vertebrae animal. So you're also a small brain, though. Your sob, your sob car, your Sabbath of the Jews, y'all. You need to wake up. Okay, animal. Hmm, interesting. Now. Here is a even real Taurus field I took at my job. Notice the letter X there it makes. And when you turn away, you don't see it. Red and blue, you know, rainbow. It's magic. That is your X. 24th letter review is your 666. Or for oxygen, upside down, your 999. Whoa, or your hourglass shape? You better wake up. Now, shame on you professors of science who don't teach properly. You have a Taurus field in science. Yes or no? Taurus. What does it sound like, damn it? That is your Taurus. Yes or no? Okay. And for those new to astrology, okay, I'm a Taurus. Venus rules. T-A-U-R-U-S. You need to know this stuff, y'all. Venus, the goddess. Taurus is your Torah. Your torch. Where did it come from? Your Bible was written in Hebrew. Torah or Talmud. Here is your Taurus field. Okay, the red and blue. The Crip and Blood, Democrat, Republican, Donald Trump wears a red and blue tie. So even he's confused. Your blood is red and blue, y'all. The blue people, the Smurfs. Wow. You have a prism. Wait up. Hold on now. It's called a prism rainbow. Wake up. Reptilian brain is RB. Royal bloodline, Royal Britain. A prism is geometry. Prism. Hmm. You find saw. Ding, ding, ding. A block of wood to bow down. Sawdust is um, Nintendo DS. Oh, Jay, it's different. Prisma, the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Okay, block of wood is how you bow. Respect your damn nature. Your cortex in your brain means the bark of a tree. Bow to your trees. Woo! And saw. Okay. Well, well, in your horror movies, you have the film Saw with a hand cut off. What does that mean, people? Okay, is it just a movie? Because if you see clearly that those lines up there, you see that's magic. That's called a Taurus field for real. I'm showing you that you have the option to go up or down in terms of reincarnation. Yeah, it's not a game, y'all. <laughs> now, in Jewish law, damages. Um, it was a TV show with Glenn Close. Okay, in Jewish law, you find Abraham... Isaac, slow down, Jay, and cutting off my hand or break a leg for good luck. 
and blind my eye of Horus. Hi, um, Illuminati. Slow it down. Cut off my hand. Saw? See how it works? You need to do deeper research, truthers. You have Mishnaic. Well, where does that come from? Very simple. Your damages, right, is the Mishnah. Mishnah? Okay. What does it mean? Mishnaic pertains to the collection of binding precepts. And it's Hebrew and the rabbi people. And a mishap or mishmash. Binding. Slow down, Jay. Binding in Hebrews. You Christians and Catholics, it's a new damn day. Religion. What does it pertain to? Hmm. Let's see here. It pertains to um, monastic. Mon is the moon. Right? But uh, lejare. Hmm. Let's see. What else does it relate to? Um, I'm looking for bind. Yeah, it's in there somewhere. Divine. Monastic. Where is the bind? To bind fast. Hi. There you go. Religare. Bind. Religion. Okay, people. It is not about what you think it is. Now, your Talmud is of the Hebrew. Yes or no? Jewish rabbis. In which in your Ibit Talmud of Judaism, it's not all evil, but yes. You find in your Talmud before your Bible that it mentions minors, hi, being married and having sex. To bear, wake up people, uh, a child and a minor. That's your Talmud, okay? You need to wake your ass up. All right, now, Shabbat, okay, hmm. Now, you have Tum Tum, but what does that relate to? Hmm, an, an A on it? Hold on, Jay. Now, slow down. Hebrew, you have an A on it right here. What does that mean, A on it? You need to wake up, y'all. It is not a game. Your A on it, when you Google it, pertains to Tum Tum. Your tum to tum tum tums for your anti, what is it? Your digesting um the acid of the fucking uh, fast food you eat, and they give you a pill conveniently eat it, eat it, to eat something that's bad for you, like I don't know, alka seltzer. If you need a pill to digest the food, they're telling you that it's poison, and you are all to blame, not them. Now tum tum. Well, my brother Santos Bonacci, my mentor, says all is a tomb. Tum tum. Torah and Talmud, it means hidden and an unknown gender. Hi, with genitalia hidden. What does that mean? You need to wake up. Tum Tum, pertains to who? Hi. All is Egyptian atum, or your muta, your motor. And notice here, it's post existence and pre existence is atum. You need to wake up. That is your physical education. Sub it down, Jay. And I don't know for hip hop, you rappers out there. Your public enemy is Atum. Hmm, codes. Now, review. Hidden. Read this book, The Two Babylons by Alexander Hislop, in which my brother Santos Bonacci recommends you all read. In this book, I read this for my thesis. I whooped ass. It's an awesome book. Saturn is the hidden one. And Amen means the hidden one. It is your, it's your name. Hi, but notice the numbers 185 there. Now, I know, I know name magic. You know how I do, y'all? Review, I had someone named Rosalind drive four hours from Minnesota to give me a massage and urine therapy and a colon cleanse, an enema flush. Her license plate was 185. Go to my recent YouTube uh, build with her. It's amazing. She's awesome. What are the odds? 185? Yeah. Shows up here also in Iowa. Mm-hmm. Look, right across the street from my house. What are the odds, y'all? Because J-H-E is 185. Ding, ding, ding. Wake up, people. Get your name decoded by me. 185 is J-H-E in Pythagoras numerology, which your Freemasons like. And review, a good teacher repeats, eep it, eep it. my name J-H-E showed up in one of my own YouTube links about astrology, and my birth name is J-H-E. So it's simple. I know how to do this. Takes you back to your Alexander Hislop, the two Babylons get this book. The hidden one in it is Amen. Amen means to hide. Hmm. Like the Hebrew version. Well, pardon my language. C-U-N-T is a four Amen of the female. A four Amen, J? That you say, Christians, at your, um, I don't know, before you eat? That is your Kunti. Hi, beautiful, of the Mahabharata of India. Very good. Please respect your ancestors, Christians and Catholics. Something came before your religion. Damn it, you have a, ibit. it, slow it down, Jay, for amen in your skull. 
You are all C-U-N-T's. Do you understand? Wow, gender battles how. You're awesome but confused. Back to your oxygen or oxycute them. A lot of connections here. Now, good stuff. Oxygen pertains to what? Gen and your AK. Okay, hmm. Now, your gen, genesis of the Bible, gen, pertains to what? Hmm, to give birth. And Gemini, ding, ding, ding. Okay, J, astrology. Now watch me cook. Hi, people. Your little guy here, Will Smith, was in a movie called Gemini Man. Uh, is that duality known as mirroring in uh, mind control? You should know your shit, MK Ultra. Okay, Will Smith, huh? Mm, Gemini Man. Well, GM is General Manager, General Motors. Okay, you need to wake up. You have Prakriti of Sanskrit, means matter. Okay, and in the Hinduism, you have your matter is divided by both subtle and gross matter. Is Gemini Man. Slow it down, Jay. Prakriti. Will Smith now. Apparently, Will Smith is a homosexual and had relations. Notice the T for Taurus there. You need to wake up. That's magic. That's the Taurus field for real. You're being recorded. You need to get this shit for real. Now, your Will Smith, you know, I don't judge, is apparently gay with Dwayne Martin, an actor. That's your Dura Mater, Mother Brain, Masonic Dictionary, Demi Moore. Medical in it, doctor. So TJ Campbell uh, snitched on your Will Smith is gay. Tratia, Prakriti now. Slow down, Jay. Remember Prakriti in Sanskrit. Mm -hmm. You have Tratia Prakriti is your periodic table. Beautiful. Pertains to homosexuality, y'all. You need to wake your ass up. Wow, what is the meaning of Tratia? Tratia, darn it, what does it mean? It means, um, let's see here. I believe the third, the third leg of Tratia. Slow it down, Jay. Tratoria? Okay. You have Richard the third leg of England. That's your dick symbol? I'm not playing games here. Give it your third leg, watch me cook, is your penis, your penmanship of Isis. Okay. Woo! Homosexual, for my gaze, is Uranian. But be careful with your lust. Homosexual means Uranian. Okay. Wake up, homophobia how? Uranian, damn it, is Uranus, astrology, a star system, and it means heavenly, and the sky in Greek. So how can it be only about sex and being gross? Wow. You have homosexuality in ancient Egypt. Wow, that's pretty damn cool there. And uh, you have names like Maimonides were lesbians of ancient Egypt. Maimonide? Mermaid, Mennonite, Summertown J. It's Mary Magdalene. Hi. Well, apparently, Ibit Mammonides is an actual person in history from Spain. And he was really into astronomer, astrology, a physician, and the Torah. Hi. So was that a truther back in the day? Because the Talmud is the other version of your Bible. Now, this is about your Jewish stuff. Important. You have a, a rabbi called Rashi. Or even Solomon Bar Isaac researched that. Now, Rashi was a rabbi into perverted understandings of the Talmud and pedophilia. Why is that important to you? Mm. Lotus 158 there for my name, birth name, J-H-E. My brain did that. What are the odds? Now, here's your damn Rashi. Okay, with a beard. Right? So who is he? Ra, the sun god? Hmm, pedophilia, rabbis. Now, where did Raj Rashi study? Rashi, okay, studied at um, Worms, Germany. Slip it down, Jay. Rashi, okay? And that's Germany. That's a Jewish person going to Germany. So how did Hitler, wasn't he a Rothschild bloodline who were Jewish people? Woo! This is a Jew, German. So what happened with the Holocaust and killing of Jews, y'all? Wow. Now, Worms, Germany, blow your damn mind. You know you have tapeworms. Okay, very simple. There it goes. Intestines. You meat eaters and you vegans, you need to do an enema flush. Get an enema kit. I did it, and I passed several stones, so I don't know shit. Until I flush out my worms of Germany, they know your shit, y'all, your rabbis. Woo! Deep shit. Back to your oxygen. You are awesome but confused. Now, more connections. Notice the three nines there. Hmm. 
Oxygen. Well, spirit, irit, irit, simply means breathing. Spiritus in Latin. So if you're not breathing properly, you aren't spiritual. You're all spiritual. Now, oxygen had three nines. Review your three nines equals one nine in the tarot. Get your name decoded by me. It's pretty cool. The number nine millimeter, no. Nine inch nails, the, the group. It means all the planets. South node of the moon, review your balloonate moon bone in your wrist. And it's gold for your solar plexus in your stomach. Is the sun gold high? Illuminati means light. You know, all your planets is what? The PTA? Mmm, watch this. Your PTA, damn it, is your National Parent Teacher Association. Wow, Jay. Damn. Back to your number nine. Like your oxygen with three nines or three sixes. It is also the hermit. Okay, in the tarot. Pretty cool. Now, your damn, um, your number nine is your hermit. It's Virgo and Aquarius. You're in the age of Aquarius. Okay. But your number nine is pretty cool, right? It pertains to who? Master Jesus Christ, the illuminated one, illuminated, even Illuminati. Oh, we'll review. You have carbon 12, six protons, electrons, and neutrons in your DNA. Why is that important for mind control? Notice 158, what I say, my birth name there. Hold on. Yes. Now, your Illuminati puts the six on their eye. Illuminati, slow it down, Jay. Remember, Master Jesus, the six on their eye. Hmm, is it a game? Because in astrology, damn it, even, even, you have Lacerta, cross of Jesus, it's a constellation, has the tail of a six. Astrology or astronomy, it's the same shit, dum-dums. You have a damn reptilian brain. You are awesome, but confused. Now, let us go back. No, hold on. I got you. You have an anal triangle. How does that pertain to the um, tarot? Watch me cook. You have pyramid kidneys. Watch me cook. You have medulla pyramids in your brain. That's three triangles. Why is it important? Because, damn it, the number nine pertains to what? Three triangles within one another. And the American eagle and the snake, reptilian brain. Someone knows your shit and review your master Jesus is the illuminated one. Master Christ, number nine. Wow, incredible work. Review. Masonic Bios, Bruno Mars, Bob Marley. Hi. Watch this. Your Adam Weishat looking like freaking Mozart and Prince Hall, of the, of the Boulet, the black version of Skull and Bones. <coughs> Was a Freemason. Now, they aren't all evil, but you Freemasons come out now and come clean. Founder of Illuminati, baby-eating, blood-drinking, pedophilia, it is what it is, and was trained by Jesuits. Jesus, Master Jesus, the tarot, oxygen. <gasps> How are you breathing? Because Jesuit, it, 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 pertains to being deceitful, and Jesus, and Catholic, and protested. Testicle? Wake up, people. Now, why is it important? Revelations. Hi. 2216, your, your master, Jesus, calls himself David the Morning Star. Okay, now you need to wake up. Google Venus, it's a female symbol. Lucifer, why is it important to you as Satan, Kronos, Coronavirus, Nimrod, Shiva, Morning Star, and Venus, and means to bear children. Grizzly bear? Repeat, people. Phosphorus is the Morning Star. Wake your asses up. It's in your Uranus, your urine. Drink it for your mental health. Now, lastly, my goddess Venus. Woo! And there's the 158 for J-H-E. I was born to slay demons. Here is your Venus with a Nikon P900 camera. Nine, like your tarot. There's the real camera. And there's your NASA, your adversary, photoshopping you for fake review. Nature has a black walnut that kills um, plants. A lion will eat the hell out of a gazelle that's very fit and can run fast and high and jump higher than your high jump. They jump five feet. Your, your um, high jump people, clear four, dum-dums. Now, your insects have to get eaten. Review the spider likes flies. So who's our adversary? Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Shiva Boom, Om, J-H-E, Om, Ram, Ring, 
Ram, Saha, Suya, Yanamaha for the sun, and Om Chandra Yanama for baby JJ, Jack Joseph, who passed away on the February the 5th, 5, like 185 is 14 for 5, my name. And share this. Wow. It was incredible. You will change after watching this. And if you don't change, then you're a demon because this is your truth and there's nowhere to go. Because NASA is making a fortune. And I mean a killing off of your low self-esteem, your tax dollars, which you get broken by, and they Photoshop you. Mm, amazing work, Jay.